Sorry I'm late. I thought today would never end. Dressed as a sheep caught in a fence. And then there was another fence down, so I had to fix that. And... Oh, that was great. I was too knackered to cook, so I thought some cold chicken and cold beer. That's perfect. Okay, we've got some Greek salad and some fresh bread. I've got some cake for after. So dig in before I eat it all. Patrick? morning. Hello, um, Pete. Hmm. Cheeky bugger. <laughs> morning, Steve's. Nice boys you got round here. Mm. I was crawling with them. Sharon, this isn't just my place. You can't bring strange blokes back here. It's not a good idea. You know, Pete. He was marking out the course yesterday. Ah, you know what I mean. Other people in this house to consider. Like Grace, you mean? Yeah. Think she's better than me, I reckon. Which is probably true, hey, <laughs> being honest. No. No, it's not. No one has a right to judge you, no one. Won't happen again. Scout's honour. Thanks, mate. Thanks. Good luck with that one. Hey, you want to take a bet with your Auntie Sharon? Making money was never so easy. I don't know. I don't even know you. G'day, Terry. Hi, Maura. You know Stevie Hall? Yeah, yeah. I'm with her. I was. She's across this and, uh, yeah, 50 on H. Stewart to win. Hate the favourite. You know that's illegal. I mean, you really think Stevie knows about it? No, no. Right, well, yeah. someone has to let her know. Yeah, but she won't believe me. Maybe she'll believe you. Stevie's on a checkpoint. If I radio her now, everyone's going to hear. Let's wait until the ride's over. OK. All right, you jokers. You know the rules. At the end of every leg, you get 30 minutes to have your horse looked over by the vet. If you don't, and if you don't continue riding in that half hour, go to the beer tent, because you're done. <laughs> All right, any questions? Now, remember, it's not a sprint. If you push your horse too hard, you'll be vetted out of the way. Hey, how's Marcus going? Is he ready for this? I think so. He thinks he is. Can you wish him good luck for me? Well, why don't you tell him yourself? Look, I... I know you want to keep the marriage and everything a secret. But if you like him, you should tell him. How is this your business? Well, you made it my business when you told me. Look, he's a good guy. Tell him, he'll understand. What's the worst thing that could happen? I cannot get involved with anyone. So maybe you should just stay out of it. Everything all right? With the uh, horse? Yep. Good to go. Marcus, get it together. Right. We're being called. Let's do it. 